Today, we're a cat and we're going fishing. That sounds very peaceful and relaxing and everything, but we're going to try hard the life out of this game. Starting with whatever fish is stupid enough to bite this hook. You. We pull him up to the surface. That's worth $25 sold. We're doing this so we can, of course, upgrade from a good rod to a power rod and eventually a quick rod. But it's going to be a little while before we get there. Cuttlefish is worth $0 if he's dead. And we need bigger bait to be able to catch the yellow fish. And I'm pretty sure we can reel this one in and then we send him back into the water and he's now my bait. So now we can pull in the bigger fish. He was worth, I don't know what, new rod upgrades unlocked. We're going to sell him for $400. We now have $962. Not enough to buy anything new. Uh, unless we can upgrade our existing good rod. Empty upgrade slot. Uh, we're going to get diving lure to go deeper. Because deeper is always better. Uh, unless that fish is going to hijack me along the way. I want to go way down to see what's down there. And it's going to take a little while to get used to this. There's a cuttlefish, $50. This time we got a pink one. That one's worth $200. So we're going to keep an eye out for those. Though I have a feeling they're going to get pretty valuable the deeper down I go. Never seen those orange ones before. But if you guys want a bite, I'm sure that would be just fine. $400. And I got half a cuttlefish worth $25. There's some big valuable fish further out over here. I need to get that, whoops. I need to get that big yellow idiot out of the way. So I'm going to take the swooper, whoops. All right, well, I guess we're using the swooper as bait now. I was going to sell it because it's valuable, but we're going to use that to catch this fish. That's $450 for the mustard fish. Then we should be able to get past him and go down deeper to those orange fish that have got to be worth something. And since all the other fish are in the way, we're just going to, uh, whoops, get them out of our way. And we're going to save up a small fortune in doing so. That was a good cast going way up there. I heard a ding because something happened right. We have $3,000 and a new quest. Catch three cuttlefish. What I really want is for one of those orange fish to bite. Okay, I'm going to take this guy who right below me as soon as I can figure out how to cast. Then we're going to use him as bait to catch the big yellow fish because I need him out of the way. Got him hooked. That should be some easy money and then we can get some new fish hopefully because while these are valuable this is too slow for me. Depending on what happens to come by at this point well we could have had some better fish. Damaged fish don't count towards your quest. Well, it's not my fault they're damaged. I take no responsibility for what happens to my fish before or after I catch them. Come on bigger fish. Oh, the orange ones were looking my way. Oh, look at that guy. He's huge. I need bigger bait. I need something stupid to bite. There we go. I'm going to cast him way down deep with that big orange fish. He's probably worth enough that I'll get a pretty good upgrade. Just got to make sure this goes deep enough to get his attention. Is that going to work? You're not happy with that? All right, we'll try it again. But not before reeling in another mustard fish. Can we upgrade again for an even deeper? I'm not sure if that really matters because my line is only so long ultimately. But we'll pretend I didn't know that ahead of time. Now as long as this doesn't get hijacked by any other idiots along the way. Can you bite that please? You can have it. Okay, never mind. This is still worth 50 incredible dollars. All right, well, we're going to turn this into bait. And we're going to keep casting down towards the big guy until we get him. It's looking promising. There you go, big guy. I still need bigger bait. I'm struggling with the challenging puzzle of a casual catfishing game. But I did unlock something new. Rocket and bombs. Add a rocket to your line to cast further. I do think I like the sound of that. That's much better. Now we can catch, well, nothing. And we've got to buy one of those every single cast. Yep, go ahead and eat that. I didn't want that fish anyways. So at some point, I am going to have to bomb the fish. Okay, now that I've got a regular fish, I'm going to use him as bait to buy another one of the mustard fish. Then I'm going to try and get that mustard fish down deep enough to catch the big idiot. Okay, now we got to get a good cast with him. That wasn't great. Okay, we're going to double down and have two of these guys. But now we should be nice and cleared up, provided nothing else bites this for one of the big, big fish. Yeah, that should work. It doesn't work. Turn around, stupid. You're facing the wrong way. He's not He's not going for it. I need a slightly longer cast. Well, we're just going to catch another one of these while we're at it because why not? That's not a good enough cast. And we hooked one of the wrong fish on what would have been the perfect cast. So we're just going to keep catching useless fish until something better happens. Maybe if I lure him close enough to the surface? Nope. For the first time yet, I've caught whatever these orange things are. Kingfish worth $350. And then I've also caught one of these mean fish. And I haven't caught one of them yet. They're very slow to reel in, so they've got to be valuable. $800. Which unlocked me this shop, which means I can unlock things after doing 7 more quests and 17 more quests. But I think the $10,000 rod is going to be our best bet. Though I do have a quest to buy one bomb, so we're definitely going to do that. Now there's a bomb attached to the end of my rod, which is the way I would probably fish in real life. I think I just murdered something. But I can see how this is going to be good, because it'll get annoying fish out of the way, and then I can catch the better. 
better fish. And after catching this lonely fish, we have over $10,000. So we're gonna buy the better rod now. So this rod should allow me to cast a lot further. So that's gonna allow me to get more fish and deeper fish. So hopefully if I time this correctly, I can use this big bait to catch one of the big deep fish or even him. I would accept him because he's valuable. $800 grumper. Definitely take that and then I'm going to upgrade my rod to have a diving lure. Then it's just going to be a matter of turning basic fish into bait, catching bigger fish, turning them into bait so I can catch the really big fish. My thing just got stolen by a fish I'd never even seen before. So not only is that very annoying, but also very exciting. And I've never caught one of these either, so we're getting into new stuff. This was a Galena worth $900. Then just for fun, let's add a rocket to the super rod here and see what kind of fish are way out there in the ocean. All right, well, my thing got stolen right away, but you can see there's some cool stuff. For some reason, new rod upgrades just got unlocked, so I'm very curious to see what that's gonna be. Rising lure. And I didn't realize before that these do stack so I can make my diving lure go deep faster or the rising lure come up faster. But I'm assuming for now, the better fish are gonna be deeper. I just need to work my way down to get them. Like that yellow fish down there would be a great one for me to grab a hold of right now because I think I'd actually be able to catch one of the really big ones. But we're gonna settle for this idiot again. Unless... Oh, that didn't work at all. We're going to use him to catch a really big fish down below. Provided no one else bites along the way like this guy did. And then it's going to get eaten anyway. So that was a waste. Oh, I got a big one. I was trying to catch one of the other ones down deep, but this might be even more valuable. I have no idea what this is, but I bet it's worth a lot of money. Seraph, $3,400 for a single fish. So I think that calls for an extra diving lure. That way my thing's going to go down just a little bit quicker. Because obviously the better fish are at the bottom. Really just want to catch that fish right there because he's annoying me. It's going to be a little bit hard to actually swing the lure down to him. There we go. We're going to take him. Then we're going to cast him out for a big fish. Or you know, one of these. I need to be a lot more careful with where I'm reeling my lure. Because I can actually control it somewhat to steer away from the bad fish and towards the good ones. For example, we're going to navigate to this guy. We're going to bring him up. Then we're going to try and send him way down to the biggest of fish. Trying to avoid all the other ones along the way. We're not quite close enough. And this one's probably going to eat my lure now. But that's okay. He's worth a massive $50. There is also a very orange fish I want to try and catch who's down there. But we're going to settle for this one for now. He's worth $800. I think we can get more money for him if we turn him into a better fish. And not catch an idiot along the way. Oh, this might be good. Yeah, we're going to get one of these for the first time. The big orange whale. Big orange whales have got to be worth a lot of money. What was that? $7,000? Hellfish, $2,500. But I did unlock a boat and a new quest. Catch two round fin. I don't know what those are. So I currently have no boat, but a basic boat is only $35,000. They go up to $1.5 million, so I have a lot of fish to catch. Since I just caught a mustard fish and they turn into big bait, let's also use a rocket with him and get a horrible cast. But that might not actually be that bad depending on... Oh. Yeah, we'll take the cowfish. They're as graceful in the water as they are on land. But that is an easy $2,500. I really want to catch that orange fish that glides around down there at super speed. Oh, don't eat that. That's very expensive. Please don't bite that. I need that money. Yeah, you stay away. But while I'm at it, I might as well see if I can catch the big boy. He has got to avoid everything else along the way. And you know what? We're just going to settle for him. Might actually get away with this. Yep, go ahead and bite it, stupid. There we go. The second easiest $2,500 I've ever made. We're going to spend $400 to attach a rocket to my mustard fish once again because I want to try and catch another valuable fish that tend to hide way out here. Uh, okay, we're gonna settle for one of these then. There is a lot of strange fish over here though. I really need to get out there in a boat. I caught my round fins. The next quest is three mustard fish and I should probably be completing these quests because they unlock new stuff and get me decent money. Come on, big orange fish or, or the other orange fish. Oh, I got it. I've been trying so hard to catch this one for so long and I just hope my whale doesn't take a big bite out of it. Well, the queen fish is still worth $1,250. And I cut another one of these weirdos for $900. So maybe it's worth using a rocket more. If I could be catching like $900 fish minus the 400, what is this thing? I could be getting $500 per cast, really. Depending on what this dead eyed fish is worth, $350. So I actually lost money. And after catching another mustard fish, I have a new rod upgrade, and hopefully it's something amazing. Bait guard. Small fish are un unable to eat large bait. I very much like that. I'm going to spend $6,000 on that all day long. So now at least the little fish can't take off my bigger bait, and I can focus on biggest fish. So that should mean when I cast this very expensive fish out into the ocean, nothing but valuable fish should be able to bite it, and it would really 
really like that big one. So let's see if we can get his attention at some point. So far, not much. Though there are some new deep sea fish. So let's add a little rocket to the equation to see if we can get into new territory. We're going down deep for something we've never really seen before. Going down way deep. Seen you before. Uh, don't really want you, but I'll take you, I guess, over everything else. That's interesting. Oh, right. They're going to eat my fish still. Probably could have thought that one through a little better. But, uh, you want to bite that at some point there, big guy? He can't even catch it. Now can he catch it? There we go. At least this kind of makes up for it, because this guy's worth 2,500. And I think I lured all these kingfish to the surface, so they're all swarming right here. And they were $350 each, so I'm just going to take all of them. Should probably also take my new quest. Catch one Georgian. I don't know what a Georgian is. This is the last of the kingfish, and we're going to do him proud and send him out to get eaten by something even bigger. Gonna rocket another piece of the big bait way out there to hopefully find something new, like whatever this thing is. No, don't eat that! Oh man, now I can't see what it's worth. I guess I can, however, see what it is. That was a Sibbil fin. Probably very valuable. I think I can use it as bait still, so whatever, we'll turn it into some kind of value. Not very much though, because we're catching one of these morons. Still $800, but we're going to attach a rocket to him and turn him into big value. I want to get one of those fish, but then I don't want them to eat the rest of my fish. Oh, let's take this one. Nope, never mind. Okay. I'm determined though. Uh... Well, we got one of these again. Pretty sure all the stupid fish are out of the way now. So once he lands, we should be close to something good. Like the big orange. Can you bite that, please? 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 I would really like to catch this fish. I haven't caught one of these yet, and I'm sure it's valuable. It's a kissy fish. Yeah, that's it. Come on over. There we go. He looks like he's enjoying that. Hopefully this is a Georgian, and hopefully it's also worth like $100,000. It was a Georgian. I didn't really see what it was worth. $11,000? And that gives us a new quest of one Turgeon, creatively named. Did it say we have a new rod piece unlocked? We can buy a quick rod if we want to, which sounds tempting. And we can get cast finesse. Uh, that way we can just land our cast a little better. That's only $1,000. Why would we not do that? And then I'm also going to buy a boat. I cannot sell fish while out at sea, but I'm pretty sure I can fish for fish while out at sea. And this is where we're going to get more valuable fish, as long as I'm not being too stupid to catch them. So, oh yeah, we can cast backwards now too. Because of course we can't get you. We're going to take you. Toss fish behind you into the boat. I don't really... I kind of get it. And he stole my bait. This actually gets pretty complicated trying to catch the right fish. I want that big red idiot though. So I think if I just do a little cast here, that should be just about perfect to catch whatever this thing is. This has got to be worth something. That's a turgeon. $7,200. Let's bring him into shore because I'm not really sure how to do this. And that's a, an exotic variety bonus. We're just going to reverse until we can sell him. Okay, we got another good piece of bait hooked on. We're going to go way out here. Then we're just going to cast way out here somewhere and hopefully something good way down deep bites like those. Those are definitely valuable. Uh, oh, I got one. This is a good start. $3,400 and I'm not going to risk trying to land that in my boat so I can sell it. I'm going to bring it all the way back just to be sure. But I still have to wonder what's down there. I want something ridiculously big and expensive. Found a nice little break in it all. I don't, not sure what that was, but it's something I'd never seen before. Yeah, we're getting into some new fish. Don't know what this one is either. It takes a long time to reel them up from way down there. Beak fish, get in the boat. There's some kind of little fish that's probably actually fairly valuable that I don't think I need any bait at all to be able to catch. I just kind of lost track of where it went. There it is. Come on. Uh, well, I got half of the fish I wanted, which is more than I usually get. That's worth 1600 by itself. Oh no, I just used it as bait. All right, well, now we got one of these instead, which is less valuable, but still worth something. Actually, it's worth 2500 so I will take that. I'm going to manually bring everything back. That way I don't lose any fish. I think I got 6400 for those, and we can get a new quest. Buy two rockets. Uh, I definitely can do that. I don't really need them right now because I have a boat. But you never know what kind of little fish we're going to find way down here. That one looked like a shark. That was really big, whatever that was. Yeah, that is a shark. The shark eats live bait. Is it trying to tell me I need to have a fish on the line when my lure is way down there? Because I think I could probably make that work. It's just a matter of what size we're going to want. If I can get this all the way down to the... Oh, I'll take one of these, actually. These are valuable. There's an easy $3,400, and I really want that faster rod, because time equals money. I've taken my boat as far out as I can go, at least for now, I presume. Uh, but there were some interesting looking fish right here that I kind of want to try and catch. Though, as soon as I put the boat nearby, they left. They're right down below. They're the colorful ones. Yep, things are biting my fish. Always a pleasure. So from here, if I rock it, I may be able to soup around most of these annoying ones and get right down to the never mind. Maybe the trick is to take a medium-sized fish and then cast it out, because then a lot of the little ones won't be able to even bite this thing. But hey. 
That's a good theory at least. I literally landed on one of these. I could catch these from the very beginning. I'm gonna send this thing for a shark. Really hope there's a shark down here to eat this thing. All sorts of new fish down here. And it's getting darker. I feel like we'll get a light at some point. What is that thing? That's like a glowy shark. Would any regular sharks like to bite my fish? Are you a shark? Did I bite you? What's happening? I think it's taking my fish away. I think we're stuck. I think this might have broken... Huge hook unlocked. I don't know what just happened. Do I... Am I supposed to catch something with this? Ooh, how about one of you? Do you want to bite my thing? I bet you're super valuable. Bite it. We somehow got a huge hook. I'm just not really sure what I'm supposed to do with it or how we really even got it. The shark eats live bait. Well, it took my huge hook away, so... These are new. I bet this is going to be worth a few bucks. Those are also new, but they're not from as deep, so they're probably, hopefully, less valuable. Depending on what this is, I'm going to cast it back down or take it in right away for money. $6,600 is profit to me. So we're going to sell all of those. That puts us over $35,000. I need to catch three stop fish. But before I do that, I'm going to unlock the quick rod. I'm hoping that means it's quicker. It doesn't really feel quicker yet, but it can have more attachments. So we'll see how this goes. Anyways, we're going to send this medium fish way down deep until something like that bites it. And hopefully this thing is valuable because I've never caught one of these either. Oh, we have. That was the one that got eaten earlier. So you go in the boat. I really need to get the bait guards and stuff, though this rod can cast a long ways. So we're going back out to the deepest of waters. That way we can hopefully catch something good from down deep. We don't have a diving lure on right now, but I feel like we'll be able to make do without it. I would take one of you again. Sure we will. This by himself, detergent, is going to make me enough to buy all the upgrades I need for my rod. We got two fish. They're worth $10,000 between them. So then I'm going to buy a diving lure. Then I'm also going to buy a bait guard which I don't have enough money for because it's really expensive. We'll settle for a cast finesse and then I'm going to take one more diving lure. As long as I have the bait guard, I will be happier. So we need to save up the money for that. And that shouldn't take long because there's some very valuable fish. Especially now that I have the diving lure. What? I didn't know you could eat those. You're too small to bite at something that big. Well, that's super annoying. So let's see if we can catch something a little bit bigger like one of these. I don't think I've caught one of these yet. This is a garump for $5,000. Did not mean to cast that back in the water, but I guess we're using that for bait now. So all we need to do is catch another garump. So that actually worked out. Would not mind a better fish sorting uh, mechanism in this game. Really don't want one of those, but I also wanted to find something super rare out here. There's clearly some very interesting... Whoa, look at him. You want one of these? I didn't know I could steer the boat or drive it around while I was reeling in. That changes everything. Anyways, this guy should be pretty good bait. I'm going to try and get him down deep to catch one of those rare fish. Well, trying to avoid everything else along the way. And that's not going to be easy to do. Nothing a little rocket won't help. Now we just need to avoid all the idiots along the way. But I'll still get this very deep. That's a big fish. You need a huge hook. It ate my fish. I found a huge hook. $5,000. That is kind of interesting though. Chain fish without recasting and hook most huge fish. So I would have actually caught whatever that was. And then I would have made a ton of money off of it. If I had more money right now, I would actually try that for $5,000. But I don't. So we're just going to hope for the best with this moron. Give me a medium value fish. I would be happy with medium value, please. Are you medium value? I'll take you whatever you are. I think that was worth $8,400. Get in the boat. The whale just swam by and I really don't want to hook one of those right now. Not without a big hook on. Also don't want any of you. I will take that other fish down there though. Hopefully he keeps swimming this way. I would be perfectly happy to hook him. Oh. Right. Well, since even these little fish were $900, we're going to come in to sell. That gives us $19,000. And the bait guard is the first thing I want to buy. It's time. It's time for me to be really stupid and buy the hook for $5,000 while casting this fish. Not deep enough. Hopefully this hook stays on for a second. Is it still there? I think I lost it. I think I spent $5,000 on a bad cast. Yeah, if that's the worst thing I do today, it still won't be too bad of a day. I'll take one of you. No, not you. Anyone else would have been fine. I did, however, hook one of these. So that's going in the boat. And then I finally also caught one of these things. I've been circling around these forever. Skitter. $1,400. Get in the boat. Never mind. We're using you as bait now to catch another one of you. And history repeats itself as I missed cast for the third time in a row. Finally found the snob fish. It's actually actually a very basic fish. It's just way out here, so it's hard to find. Got a pretty good cast this time. Got a pretty big... No, not one of you. Nope, don't bite that. Don't bite that. Don't bite that. Yeah, idiot. Let's try that again. Hopefully not grabbing the attention of a shark right away. 
I want something shark size, but just not a shark. Or if I had live bait on here, I'd be happy to do it with a shark. But it looks like we're not going to catch much of anything. Except maybe that. I'll take one of these. Oh, never mind. Everyone else wants a bite too. That's fine. $700 is plenty of money for a fish. At least I managed to turn it into whatever this thing is, because this thing's worth $8,400. Gawker. Get in the boat. I have a good feeling about this one. Is that another Gawker? I think it was. I probably should have waited and grabbed that, because now we got a bunch of other idiots coming in, and this'll work. No, never mind. Everyone else wants a bite too, of course. $1,250, that's fine. Just sold that load of fish for about $12,000. That's going to allow me to buy some more bombs and dynamite. That way I can do better casts. And also maybe a big hook so I can actually catch some real fish again. Okay, we're going to go for it again. Rocket plus huge hook equals big cast going deep. And we'll be able to hook pretty much whatever we want. Hopefully it's not a shark because a shark will take my lure away very quickly. I would settle for that thing. I don't know what that is. Come on, do you want a bite? Oh, I got whatever this is. This better be worth more than $5,000, otherwise I just wasted money. This is a Trumbull for $9,400. Get in the boat. I do still need to catch more snob fish, but I want this guy. Perfect. He's definitely one of the more valuable fish, especially considering I don't need a giant hook to catch him. $3,400. Well, time to be stupid. I'm going to do exactly that again. Huge hook plus rocket equals big fish. That was a pretty actually decent cast. Why are you biting my hook? Maybe I get a shark this way, though. That's live bait and a huge hook. That actually might work out not bad. Shark. Watch now be the one time we don't see a shark. Uh, does anyone want to bite my live bait? I don't think the shark's goal is deep because it's too dark. I'm just going to reel slowly up until we get something's attention. Ooh, you're a shark. Oh, I think we're going to catch the shark. I think this actually worked. Come on, be worth a fortune. You need live bait and potentially a big hook for this, so this might be a very valuable fish. $64,000. I'll take it. I'm not going to risk throwing that in the boat because knowing me, I'd probably recast with it, and then I would have $64,000 bait. And I don't need $64,000 bait. Sell. $78,000, which isn't really enough to buy anything new yet. All the upgrades are actually that expensive still that we can't buy anything new. But what we can do is buy another rocket and another giant hook with all that money. Then hopefully catch some kind of whale or even this thing. Don't know if that's worth $5,000 to hook that. Probably not because it's not big enough, but I want to see what this is. Catfin, $6,500. Whoops. Oh, okay. Off you go then. Didn't want you anyway. Only cost $5,000. Well, when it doesn't work right the first time, we just keep trying until it does. They don't want anything. I think that's a fish I actually already caught. So he's probably pretty happy to not be on my line right now. What was that? Oh, that's the whale we want. Will the whale be coming back at some point? Because I wouldn't mind catching it. If I stay here too long, the shark's going to come back. Whale. I would settle for him because I think I would still make a profit on my $5,000 hook. Do you want to bite? Yeah, you do. Max active quest. That was a Georgian for $11,000, so I did make a profit. Get in the boat. Then we're going to do it again because I want a whale. Did I? Are you hooked? What? How did I hook something so s small? I might have done that incorrectly. That's okay because there's some pretty big fish hiding just below the surface right here somewhere. Like this... Yeah, well, you get the idea. We'll take the red one because he's worth $7,200. Get in the boat. <laughs> nah, never mind. We got some more catch and release. Okay, again. Whoops. Back to the quick rod. Uh, and then we're going to want the rocket because then hopefully we'll get down to a whale or something similar. Oh, is that a whale? <gasps> we got the whale. I don't know if it's worth more than a shark, but we're about to find out. This is a big fish. The biggest I've seen, in fact. It's got beautiful eyes. $85,000, and we unlocked Nightfall. Tiger shark. This is a tiger shark? Right, well, you're coming with me. Just so we can sell you for a total of $96,000. We have $155,000 and a new quest, which we would love to explore next time.